Hi Haleens! Spicy peppers have a couple uses, and one of those uses are two secret ones that some people probably know. We'll learn the best places to farm spicy peppers, and if you don't know the secret uses, you'll find out today. I'm Nico, and this is my fun, quick and easy series explaining where to find the fruit in Breath of the Wild. Basically, the first two rows of materials in the inventory. Is this a fruit? You can always use an object map to find it yourself, but I did the research for you. I hope you find this useful. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. And if you want more Zelda content, I hope you consider subscribing or at least checking out the channel. First, there are a few places to farm spicy peppers. Gerudo Desert has more than 100, but they're spread out throughout the desert. There's about 30 at the Lanayru Road East Gate. Even though there's only 30, I mentioned this location because it's where you can farm a Lionel, a Hinox, and close by there are some chill shrooms. And this location is probably the best place to farm Nadra at the same time. And one great place to farm them is at Satori Mountain because there's 27 of them in the same location. And the last place to farm them is all around the Rito village. You can also collect some Tabantha wheat, cold darners, rugged beetles, and hot footed frogs while you're here. The main use for spicy peppers is for cold resistance. Each one will give you two and a half minutes worth. But you cannot get level two cold resistance with only spicy peppers. Check out Croton's cooking video for more information. The second use is to burn them. If you burn them, they will create an updraft. The last random use is to feed them to sand seals. If they see it, they'll eat it and you can approach them while they're eating. Not very useful, but still very interesting. That's what I got for spicy peppers. Volt fruit are next. I hope you find this useful, interesting, or entertaining. Give it a thumbs up, and if you want more Zelda content, consider subscribing or at least checking out the channel. See you next time!